<laughs> there was a walkway up there? I, I'm, I'm almost sure it is. Wow. It, it was. And then when you it was a sh when you got down to the end of this thing, which was right there about where you turn into that bank, uh -huh. right there in that corner, a shoe shop was there, and you come down those steps, and that's where you got on the le level ground there. And... Um, I'm thinking it was. I can remember those definite steps down there. Hmm. Why else would it have been steps there if you didn't walk down the, a walkway there? What you call them would have been back down along here, that okay. bike shop and thing. It used to be a grocery store and a something there years ago. And right as you crossed the little street, it was uh, it was must have been old old fashioned day. Mm -hmm. Uh, it looks like that you were right up there where it's apartments in that building that it just showed. Liggett's. Okay, that's downtown right. The Liggett's was here, Sears was here, and a shoe store the other side of Liggett's. The jewel box? Yeah, a jewel box. Was, was Sears was between the jewel box and Liggett's. Oh, okay. I think where you go in that pawn shop, I don't know if you've ever been in it, mm -hmm. but it takes up where Sears and the jewel box was. Oh, That's okay. when you walk through the walkway there. Okay, here we Archway. go. This is what I was looking at. So this is right downtown Radford, huh? Mm-hmm. can't believe all those people. It must have been some kind of parade or something. Mm-hmm. I was going to try to look and see who that was in that car. <laughs> It looked like to me that could have been before the 50s. You so see a few automobiles in there. Let's see. No, I guess that's the head parking meters. Yeah, that's a 56. No, oh, that's, right that's what I start to say, yeah. There's a, like the 53 Ford was sitting over in that. Yep. Now, that, that guy there, I should know him. The face looks familiar. If old Clayton was here, he'd tell you who it is. <laughs> <laughs> so Montgomery Ward was where? Do you remember? Yeah, it was... Um, is this right? the... He, in other words, whoever, whoever took his picture was looking downtown toward, say, University Motors. Mm -hmm. They were up there somewhere about where the red light is, right. and Montgomery Ward was there, Sears Cross. In other words, Montgomery Ward was more or less in front of Sears. They were across the street from one another. Mm -hmm. And then, you know where it's a place you step up in, some kind of, they have different kind of shops there? Mm -hmm. Uh, Kroger used to be in downtown. Right? Really? And next to it was A&P. Wow. And A&P left and Mickamac come in that building. Hmm. It used to be um, let's see, it was a Walgreen drugstore up on the corner at the red light where those buildings are. Mm -hmm. It's doctor's offices and all that stuff in there. Mm -hmm. And that was the, that was the thing that was the top dog. People come into Radford and so forth. It was a big drug store with a, uh, eat, an eating place. Found everybody that was downtown so went in there for drinks and mm -hmm. sodas and whatever. That's when they made the sodas and whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember barely remember that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. You take that where Walgreen was. Now that saloon thing, I can't get that in my mind. That's going to have to come to me with a little time. But down, say from where that red light is, mm -hmm. and you come on down uh, 
it, it, in fact, it, it was a credit way there, and then the jewel box, and I'm then see what this other thing down here is. Sears, Leggett's, shoe store, Merck shoe store on the right, and it used to be a theater right <sighs> there in the middle of town. Mm -hmm. Dang. Not Radford, it was on up in the middle of the morning. But then... There was another theater, huh? Yeah. I didn't know that. I believe it was called Virginia Theater. And, uh... It, it was two five and tens. It was a Roses five and ten. And, uh... What is five and ten? Barbershop. So do you remember a barbershop downtown? Oh yeah, it's always been downtown next to the saloon. Yeah, it's always a bomber shop. That was across from that building. If you know, there's a big building there across from University Motors. Mm -hmm. And that where they tore that opening out there, it was Carson Drugstore. Hmm. And what was that, Rafford? Jennifer Smarts. Rafford Furniture. Yeah. It's in there where they put that new building. I mean, that new eating, eating place just past the red line. Okay. Uh -huh. What about Jennifer Smart? The Carson's drugstore. Her grandmother, I think, ran, they ran that Carson's drugstore. Mm -hmm. Velma Carson was in there. I just can't get over these buildings right here. I can't figure well, out see, where that is. See where it's not showing the name of something. That building is dog oh, man. Up there where Dean's is. Mm hmm It was an Exxon station. Well, it, I guess it it was really an Exxon station down, right down there in the middle of town where University Motors is. Mm -hmm. If you come east from there, it, there was an Exxon station. Now, a guy named Bill Bullitt ran it. Bill Bullitt. Uh-huh. Next to it was a pure oil station. Mm -hmm. Winkler's run it. And next to it was a Quaker State or what kind of gas Quaker State say? And a guy named Simpkins run it, small guy. Mm -hmm. And then that it was train station property, and then like where Wachova Bank is, right down through mm -hmm. there like that. But on the corner, or right across where the vacant lot is, where they have that farmers market was First and Merchants Bank, a big two-story building, lawyers in it, upstairs, Ted Dalton and Poff and all of them were in that building. And then I think next door to it, down on a lower level, was a drugstore. A guy named uh, Wilson run it. Underneath Leggett? No. On the, we're going to the right-hand side going out of town. Oh, okay. Where, where that Farmer's Market or whatever. Oh, yeah, I know where that is. Close to the main street was this bank, First and Merchants. At one time, it might have been called Farmers and Merchants back in that uh, Changed names, I know, at one time. But, across, I, I want to say about where that flower shop is, there was a department store, Felix. And then there were some women dress shops on the, but before, there, there were dress shops and things, I think, came in there after some of them grocery stores moved out. And when I was a little kid, as I say, Kroger, A and P, were right downtown in there. I always, the thing I can remember about that Kroger is you had to step up in that doorway to it. Mm -hmm. And, uh, <laughs> Yeah, and 
as they left out Montgomery Ward, possibly from that place. I that's things, cool. Things kind of come to me from time to time. The old Clayton, he, I don't have that Clayton. <laughs> see, uh, <sighs> see, I think it was about, about 80. No, 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 no. That was, no, it wasn't 80. It was 78. Mm -hmm. That wasn't what brings him in to be that. Because uh, he was young. In 78? <laughs> But I'm just giving that as an example. He, he, he can. I'm gonna tell you what I tell you might be within five years or something. But oh, Clayton, he brings it on in. Phillips. Mm -hmm. He's he's deceased now. He died in the last few years. He and a guy named Homer Cole run a hardware just in there where. Um, is it a Photoshop or something right there about the red light? That's right. I declare I know that woman. Thank you. Very cute stuff. Sayer. You know, it, it really, it might have been a Sayers. Uh -huh. Something to put Sayers. Something right next to Lake. It's come to think of. I think some guys out of West Virginia. They say I own that thing of Sayers. Yeah, that might say Sayers. I think that, that does. Sayers Brothers? Yeah. Yeah, that's what that says. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs>